All right. We're in the train graveyard. Very familiar. Don't say that. Hey, is that a ghost? Yep. Ah! Gotcha. Surprise. Want me to turn this into a lawn graveyard? <laughs> no, thank you. Sass. Got the sass and the bad jokes and the puns. Um. Oh, here it is. Can I cut? Oh. Interesting. All right. Ooh, Vampire Prime. Gotta go catch us a good old pre Vincent monster. Wow. They're white bats. Hold on. Who has Libra? Or have I seen these guys already? I have ice bats. Oh! Oh, that was a long time ago. Alright, blindness. We have a couple things for that, don't we? Uh, what is it? Oof. All right, we need blind. There it is. Flash bomb on. Oh, it's only gonna do it once, though, right? Ooh. All right. Well, that'll stick for a bit, and we still one-shot these. Awesome. Did what is going on? They just float and not flutter. Weirdos. Wow. Interesting. So we want the ice one or the werebat? I think we're gonna go werebat this time. <laughs> Good choice. We're out of blinds. <laughs> it was worth a shot. Hey, know what they call a locomotive with vampire fangs? Mm hmm. Uh, I sense it bad the joke coming. Honestly, I'm more impressed he knows the word locomotive. A choo-choo train. <laughs> because it's got fangs. Fangs that chew. I... Yep, explain the joke, it makes it better. Alright, where are we at? That takes me back. There's just no hope for us any the more. Any the more. All right, uh, what can I get? Nothing. You, oh, nope, hold on. There's still trains to run across. It's a loot chest, oh my. Mirror jewels are worth it. We're gonna take the long walk down the other path that goes nowhere. Oh, music's good though. Just kind of comes out of nowhere in this place. Oh. Do we not know what these are? <laughs> it's a skull eater. Oh boy. I've always wanted one of those. Yep, let's get you guys, uh. Oh gosh. Okay, not dead? Perfect. Let's just lever this thing and see what it is. Uh, regen? No. Something that can uh, nibble me to death in one shot. 
No, thank you. No, no, no. Oh good, that makes me happy. You're going to be very, very useful in this area. You know, not that I'm saying they should have used oh, anything from this for Final Fantasy VII Remake, but I wonder if they kind of used the atmosphere a little bit from this game to just build off of. They had a lot to go off of too. Like there's there's a ton of just spooky quiet no music areas in games, but I I'm getting a very similar sense of Final Fantasy VII, uh, VII-ness here, so just curious. Wow! Uh, up and down, I guess, then. So what do I do now? Go with the flow. All right. Oh boy. Does this do something that I want to wait on? Nope. That is the way I... Oh, that is the way I want to go. Alright. After... The treasure chest. But um, first pass path was optional. <laughs> yep, I was wondering when that was gonna happen. First pass was ask, not speak. Path was optional, and now not quite. Hold on, what happens with this thing? They just freeze. <clears throat> oh, lightning's theme. Okay, so a ice pack. Yeah, that. Yes. Inflict oblivion. I really need to figure out a way to squeeze an oblivion user um, onto my stacks. So we're heading that way. Yeah, yes, the man. Um, I should. I'll check later. Oh, I see a treasure chest way over there. Hopefully, I can get to it. Keep our fingers crossed. You know, it's been a while since I played a horror game or watched a horror anything. Oops. I'm wondering if I do pick one up, if it's actually going to be like tense, nerve wracking. All right. Oh, well, that sucks. Never mind. We will not inflict oblivion with an item. Ah, I, 
I don't know, it, it used to just not appeal to me at all, but... You know, maybe it'd be fun now. I'm older, I have old man reflexes. Uh, yep, that's it for here. So maybe jump scares will actually jump scare me. Well, that can't be right. Two treasure chests side by side. Oh, am I going the wrong way? I am not going. Uh, I might be going the wrong way. Hmm. Crap. Oh, we can't go inside the train. All right, well, let's drop a car. Really? Okay. Uh, it's a gimme golem. I'm gonna go back before I get too far. Backtracking is not fun. Let's see what we can find over here. I wonder if there's like a, a spooky mimic. An undead mimic chest. Hello. Um, we have... Just dark attacks. Okay. So you're a bunch easier to catch. Except I don't think we... Uh, we have the items. Never mind. Yo, yeah. Oh my gosh. So... <laughs> How's it going, drumstick? Uh, I had a guy pop in yesterday and... I get that's fine. He was doing like, hey, do you want your stream to grow kind of stuff? And it happens and usually I'm okay with it. But I had some solicitors come to my door like three times. Um, not yesterday. When did I stream? What's today? Friday? Tuesday. I think it was Tuesday or Wednesday. And I was done. So I kind of laid down the law for him and said, you can stay. But if you want money, you're not going to find it here. So yeah, I had to change my chat rules a little bit. I'm uh, not tired of being nice to solicitors. It's just there's been a lot. <laughs> so yeah. I'll probably change it soon so it's not as like if you're a solicitor, you're not welcome here, but I still want them to drop by and if they want to hang out, that's cool, but if they're just here for business stuff, then it's better for them and for me if they uh, they go somewhere else to do their, their sales pitches. Where's my dark stuff? Oh, I don't have any. Ah, uh, sorry vampire, you're going down. But anyways, how was your week? Four lawyers, oh my gosh. What were they trying to do? Like, we want to buy your house for our company. Speaking of houses... How was your, uh, your shopping spree last weekend? Yes, I get texts about that for my house. We're wondering if you're willing to sell. No. Uh, that was not the gimme golem items, I think. Okay, don't have one of those. Oh, today. All right. Did you find everything you wanted? What am I missing? 
Man, it's so expensive, but it's so nice when you get like clothes that come out like you're expecting them to. Yeah, washer and dryers are not cheap. Is it one of the, uh, like, the Internet of Things thing where it connects to your Bluetooth and you can monitor it wherever you go? But I did not, okay. I oh, found it. Yeah, when we picked up an app, okay, yeah, that seems, it seems weird to use an app for a washer dryer, it's something I grew up just pushing the power button and letting go on its own. <laughs> I, I don't know what the app monitors. But if that monitors how dry clothes are as well as my dryer does, then it's not going to be right anyways. Oh, nice. I was wondering what you'd need 50 ounces of uh, detergent to, to clean, but okay. It just shoots it in there whenever it needs to. That's really cool. <laughs> Tell me you're old without telling me you're old. Get excited about appliances. Yeah, the last appliance we have to upgrade is our dishwasher. <laughs> It's good stuff. Where is this taking me? Oh, okay. And they're so nice. I can't wait until I can just like, my basement's done. I can buy couches and a, a nice projector for my basement area and relax. Does it really? Two to four gallons for a dishwasher for the new ones is crazy. I didn't know that. We're far up. How, how new, well I guess how old are new ones? I know our dishwasher's about 11 years old, so I don't know if that counts. Ah, close. Well, when our dishwasher breaks down on us, then we'll definitely get a new one. Abyss, huh? That sounds scary. Alright, you guys gotta hit this dude at least once every five tries. Um... I don't do the dishes. My wife and I have an agreement that I do the, the clothes and she does the dishes, so I don't know. She doesn't pre-wash, so at least not very often. But I read that... well, I read. I, uh... That bat must really like high seems like I'm an outlander. Who? Me? Um... Fine, dummy. She said bat, not batty. My wife told me that there are some dishwashers dishwashers with sensors that clean less if you pre-wash your plates. And so they don't get everything off like they should if you miss uh, parts. So, I don't know. The, uh, the technology makes me seem like a get-off-my-lawn kind of guy. Like, why, why wouldn't you just 
scrub food off your plates when it's not caked on there and dried. But I'm not in charge and my, my dishes come out just fine when she does them, so I'm just complaining about nothing. Looks like we've climbed up even higher. Oh boy. Either that, or we've sunk to a new low. Either that, or we've sunk to a new low. Yeah, since I've been home alone without anybody, yeah, little shoveling is very new. Um, I'll rinse my dishes off, and because I let them sit in the sink forever. I don't have a full load of dishes to do for five or six days. Ooh, a new mirage. Let's see. Uh, these guys are weak to what? Fire. I do not have fire. I do have this, though. All right, do we have an all? Ease. We do. Nice. Oof. Uh. But yeah, my uh, two weeks of being a bachelor is um, officially over on Monday. The right thing to do? I think it's the right thing to do. It's the right thing to do. Everything's coming home and my kids actually get a summer. Lucky guys. We are cruising through this area. That was hiding something from me. Is there? Ooh, there is. Hmm. Ooh. To get that chest, I have to go all the way around and maybe back. I don't want to do that. But yeah, I've noticed though that cleaning, just home chores, have been therapeutic while I'm alone. I have a ton of time to think after I'm out of work, but cleaning just kind of helps. However, it's definitely not like that when there are kids around, but... When you're doing it at your own pace, it is not too bad. So that's not too bad going back around. Yeah, bathrooms are stupid. Why do they get so dirty? Like, dishes are food, vacuuming's just dust and pet hair if you have pets. Bathrooms are a whole different kind of ick. Come on, team, you gotta bop him. Yep, I'm saving those for Sunday right before everyone gets home. They look clean, it looks like I kept them clean the whole time, and I will earn those brownie points. It's ventless. What? 
I didn't know they made anything ventless. That would have been so nice. I had to uh, poke a hole in my house for our new set. We moved ours to the basement from upstairs and... Oh, that was a pain. Now I want my combo to just die so we can get a ventless washer and dryer. How do they work? Do they just... They're magic? <laughs> okay, that's fair. I just, I imagine the room getting so hot. There's an obs- what are these things? Right, so does the heat pump pump it into the room, or is it just like a heat pump outside somewhere? Like, I've- I'm still trying to- Jeez. Is it like a, a fridge coil? Like, I don't know how this thing works. I am super curious, though. Let's see. Right, but the heat's got to go somewhere. I'm just curious where the heat goes. Oh, confusion. Oh, okay. Cool. I love science. I wish I uh, was smarter and understood it better, but that sounds awesome. I still can't wrap my head around a dryer not creating a lot of heat. But yeah, if that's just like sits in any room of the house and doesn't create a lot of heat, that's awesome. Uh... I should have Libra the other stack. Who's up? I'm up. Where's Libra? Right here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, so you just bought something from like Hogwarts and it's gonna sit in your house and do whatever it says it does magically. <laughs> I'm happy for you. That sounds awesome. Did I just hit myself? I may have. Oops. Alright, let's see if we can get this stack to fall over. Oh, there it goes. Alright, what do we need to do to this guy? Evade his attacks. Well, we have all the time in the world. Um, Regen Lon again. Oh my goodness. And there we go. You know, I still have to see that movie. I've heard really good things about it and the book. I just haven't gotten around to it. I had a coworker that talked about Ready Player One all the time. That was all he could talk about when it came out. Oops. This dude's not gonna make it. All right. Is there a second movie? 